Why, hello, and welcome back to another episode of Voice of the Rings. I'm your host and guide, Zelda Iron Shield. And today, my friends, let me show you real quick a little guide on how to uh, select the new uh, starting area inside the game. So there's always a little intro that you can use inside when you play Lotro when you make your character for the first time. There's this little intro, and if you're someone who buys, and I have a video of on is it worth buying it, I would say a little spoiler, it, it is. I think the new expansion before the Shadow is worth it, uh, especially just the flat $20 one. But if you do get that one, you can go ahead and um, go in here and choose your new area to start. So you always get to start normally in the uh, Angmar, level one area, but when you make a new character, let's just go through it real quick here and I'll just show you, okay? So when you go in the new area normally, you go into uh, here, you choose your character, whoever you wanna be, there's a whole new, uh, you could, a lot more races can play different classes, right? But you say continue, go through here, and you get this little thing now at the top. So this is, it's actually pretty cool, all right? So you got your little randomizer, they've add this whole new tab up here, and you could randomize names. There is, uh, Lord of the Rings Online is pretty careful on what names you can use. So, have fun with it, but some things it's gonna say are gibberish, or, you know, oh, you can't use that, inappropriate, that kind of thing. They're good about that, but you can find something. There's a whole thing here on the left that shows you how to name stuff, to help if you wanna do, like, a lore role-playing name. So now, basically, right underneath here, we have starting tutorial. Shadows of Angmar, which is the one you'll get as a free-to-play. It's been the one in the game forever. But if you're someone who wants something new, your new player wants that new area before the Shadow expand this expansion, right? Which is between levels 1 and 32. You just click this and you can choose that. You can also say skip tutorial. Skip the new user tutorial and begin your adventure and arch it for the men and hobbits or Erdluin for elves and dwarves. Or you can do the intro with this one where you begin your adventure and the new character tutorial tailored to your character's choice, right? Which again is special, um, it's tailored as in it's for your race. So the originals are uh, dwarves start here, elves do this one, hobbits do this one, men do this one, right? Um, the race of men, man. Uh, before the shadow is the new one, which basically all your characters will start in the same place. You just click it and then say okay, and there you go, you're set up. So starting tutorial, put your name and choose your wherever you want your history to be from all your stuff, create character. Then you'll, once you create your character, I'm gonna randomize a name, I'm gonna get rid of this character in a second. Oh, that one's taken, interesting. The randomizer used one that was already taken. All right, so there we go. And now you hit enter Middle Earth, right? So we'll go ahead and enter Middle Earth real quick. You can see this is the new area, right? The new tutorial area. So um, hopefully this helps you out. If you're a new player, you're brand new, you're like, so why did I start in the old original place? You need to know that you need, when you're making your character, you actually have to choose, okay? Right there under your Speaking under your name. of how you came to this place of so, safety. This Rivendell, the last homely house. Little story. Sea, but speak swiftly before the shadows deepen. From where did your road lead? All right, so then you have this whole little story when you walk up to the sky. There's even some good voiceovers. Of course, you know my channel. If you're new to my channel, you don't know, I have a whole series on where I do voiceovers through the game for stuff that isn't voiced, right? Because they voice some characters and others, there's big paragraphs with nothing. So that's what I do for the storytelling. Um, and then I do guides, obviously. That's why you're watching this, I hope. Um, and then when you go up to this, um, Welcome to got a nice little Traveler. voiceover right there. And uh, then basically, to give you a little note, so you start here because you chose that new one. Again, you will have to buy for $19.99 that new expansion to play in the Moss Word area and you get Swan Fleet's quests and Cardolan. But don't forget if you are free to play and you don't want to spend any money on the game, you're brand new. You can norm do the normal start, which will this one will probably grade out and not uh, won't have the choice, right? Just start in the Angmar, the Angmar one, and if you're a dwarf, you're gonna start up here at Thorin's Hall, or the elves are gonna start here, down here in, in um, Kellendim, and then the hobbits are gonna start in the Shire. Technically, the hobbits start over in Archit, actually, and the the men, the race of man, well, you, whether you are a male or female character, will start in one of these locations. That will be the normal Angmar, okay? Um, so, those are the two differences, right? So if you are someone who doesn't wanna buy the new before the shadow expansion, I understand. You'll still start in those areas. But if you are, and you wanna have that new intro, and you want to be put in Swanfleet and start at Moss Ward, you need to select that, okay? That was the point of this little guide video, to help you guys out. It's really, really important, and I hope people will find this before they miss that, because that's something that um, I think if someone was rushing through the character creation, might not realize is important. It might just be like, oh, you know, just leave it on you know, Shadows of Angmar. And they don't realize they bought 
they're starting in the original area and they're not getting to start in the new Moss Ward area. Okay, so that was the goal of this video. I hope that helped you. Don't forget to like and subscribe if I did earn it. I do a lot of Lord of the Rings content on this channel. It's not just Lotro, but we do a lot of Lotro. So if you're a new Lotro port player, you'll want to subscribe too. And thanks to my Patreon. Subscribe buttons there if I earned it. Next episode will be up there in the top left and over there will be um, my Lotro tale where I do voiceovers. So see you all. Have a great day, Miller. Stay happy. And I'll see you all in the next episode of Voice of the Rings. Baruch Kazad, Kuzad, I menu.